Hey everyone, so I'm going to show you how to download the Google Play Store right there on a Amazon Fire device. This one in particular will be the 2023 Amazon Fire HD 10, uh, one that just came out a couple months ago, uh, a little while ago. Uh, so first thing you gotta do, oh, and this will work or should should work with pretty much any Amazon Fire device. Uh, you just have to follow a couple different steps which I will mention when we get to them. Uh, first thing you gotta do though, go into your settings. Then from your settings, find your security and privacy. And then from there, we need to go to this apps from unknown sources button. Go into that, let it load in here. Then you'll see Silk Browser up top here. You have to click on it. And then you have to make sure you allow it from this source. Otherwise the rest of this will not work. So make sure that is highlighted. Uh, that is that nice goldish color. All right, then you can get on out of that. Then you have to go into your Silk Browser. You don't use any other browser, but use your Silk Browser. Uh, this is the one that comes with this device. And we will do a quick Google search for how to download Google Play Store on Amazon Fire device. All right, so like I said, type in there how to download Google Play Store on Amazon Fire. We'll do a search for that. Then the one I always use for me, it will be the second one here. Yours might be a little bit different, but it is the How to Geek uh, website. And it says how to install Google Play Store on Amazon Fire tablet. Go ahead and hit that. Run into your now. I'm not going to do each of these steps because I already have the Play Store on here. I'm not sure what would happen. Uh, we'll just keep scrolling down here. You can read through this if you want. It's just basically going to say the same things I'm going to say here. So we'll scroll through. Let's we'll keep on scrolling down here until you get to this part here. And yeah, let's just make sure this is the correct part. All right, so now we will get to this first part. So first part will be your account manager. Now this is where it might vary for you, will vary for you depending on which Amazon Fire device you have. So on the left side here, it tells you which device it is for. You have to make sure you hit your actual device. Uh, so this is the Fire HD 10. Uh, I'm not sure what generation this new one is, but so we're just going to hit it for this 10 here. So you'll click it and then you'll wait for this to load in, screw down a little bit, hit download APK. And then it will say something like, this is from an unknown source. Do you, are you, uh, it might hurt your device. Do you want to actually download it? Hit yes to download it. So download that, let it do its thing. Uh, of course, pause this video at any time if you guys need to. All right, then we will go on down to serv Google Services Framework. Again, find your actual device, click on it. Uh, it might be a good idea to actually click and hold and then open it up in a new uh, tab so we're not going back and forth. Uh, again, go down, download it. Make sure you actually do download it. And we'll go back. And we'll scroll down a little bit more to where you see Google Play Services. Find your actual device, click it, or like I said, you can click, hold. Let's see, click, hold, open a new tab. And then this one is a little bit different. As you can see here, it does not look exactly the same. It does not just say download APK. So we are going to find the newest one, which should just be your very top one here. And you guys can see lift this up so the top one there says Google Play services whatever at the time of this video yours might be a little different if you're watching this in the future uh, November 23rd which was like two days ago uh, time making this video so then we will hit the download arrow and then my popped up an ad I'll give her that ad now now you'll be able to see the download APK so it's a little bit different. You gotta just hit that top one, the newest version of it, and then hit download APK. All right, then we'll screw down a little bit more. And then we have, let's see. Uh, okay, that one threw me off a little bit. So just keep scrolling down here until you see uh, Google Play Store, scroll down a little bit more. And then you'll see all models, Google Play Store Universal. 
So this one will work with any of the five devices. Uh, then again, we would have the same thing here. So we'll hit this top one, uh, which is from November 16th, at the time of making this video. Again, yours might be a little bit newer if you're watching this in the future. So we'll go ahead and we'll hit that. Scroll down, download APK. Uh, now each of these four files, they are a little bit different in size. So some will take a little bit longer to download than other ones. So once you have downloaded all four of those APKs, you can get off of Silk, and then you will find your files. Click on files. This one to say there's no items. Click your bars up here. Click on your downloads. And then you should have each of them downloaded. Uh, now you want to click on these in the order that you had just downloaded them. Uh, so you gotta make sure they are in that exact order, otherwise this will not work. Then when you click on these, it will pop up a message saying your tablet and person name are vulnerable to attack by unknown apps because it doesn't know what these actual apps are uh, because they don't want you actually having Google Play Store on your Fire device. Uh, just hit continue and then you'll hit the uh, download. Uh, so you do that for each of those four, just make sure you do it in order. Uh, then once you are done downloading those off of the Files app here, you should have Google Play Store and you should be able to get into it. Now there is a there is a uh, quick mention here. Uh, for some reason, not every device will work. I have had multiple, in the past, I have had multiple of the same exact device. One worked, one did not. Uh, or you might have to try this two, three, four times before it actually takes effect. Uh, I got lucky this last time, mine worked right away. But again, it might take you a few tries it might just not work whatsoever. Because again, Amazon does not want you having the Fire or the uh, Google Play Store on here. They want you using their App Store, which is terrible. Uh, but yeah, that is how you do it. Have any questions, just ask me in the comments below and I will try to answer them. Again, might not work for everybody. And you gotta make sure you hit your actual devices, uh, download APK, otherwise it might not work for you either. Thank you all for watching. Hope you have a good one. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.